here, we're dividing a quadratic trinomial by a linear binomial. X plus 5 is our divisor. And 4x squared plus 23x minus 16 is our dividend. We're going to begin the process by dividing the leading term of the dividend by the leading term of the divisor. We get 4x, and that's going to go in this column of linear expressions. 4x times x plus 5. is 4x squared plus 20x, parentheses, minus sign, underline, cancel. What goes down here? 3x. Bring down the minus 16. Start over again. Leading term on the inside. Divide by leading term on the outside. We get a 3 or a plus 3. That quotient piece gets written up top. Again, check your columns. All of the expressions should match. Multiply that plus 3 by the binomial on the side. Parentheses, minus sign, underline, cancel. What gets written down here? Negative 31. The remainder is negative 31. The way we write this answer is you could write plus negative 31 over x plus 5, but instead I'm going to do minus 31 over x plus 5. I just pulled that negative out of my numerator of my remainder and sat it out front. When we have remainders that are uh, bigger than constants, maybe a linear remainder or a quadratic remainder, you would have to factor the negative out of everything if you wanted to do something like that. Your final answer is 4x plus 3 minus 31 over x plus 5. x plus 5 is not a factor of 4x squared plus 23x minus 16. However, if I multiply x plus 5 by 4x plus 3 minus 31 over x plus 5, I will get the dividend 4x squared minus 23x minus 16. I'm going to record a separate video for the next homework example, and hopefully I'm able to link the thumbnail at the end of this video for you to click through. If not, just check the description box below for the playlist of other recordings from this long division packet. Have a great day.